If you caught GTV last year, you saw Martin, Josh, and the rest of the GT and Dino crew perform some of the hottest tricks on video. What you didn't see is me. I'm Magoo, and this is the GT demo tape. 20-year-old Dino DeLuca is the longest standing member on the Dino freestyle team. What exactly did get you involved in freestyle, Dino? Well, about seven years ago in Thousand Oaks, I saw Martin Apreo and Woody Itson riding in the skills competition. And that was the first time that I saw trick riding. And at the time, I was into racing, and that looked like more fun since I was going nowhere racing. So I thought I'd get into that. So that's probably what got you involved in freestyle to begin with, then. Exactly. Yeah. Why wasn't racing any fun for you? Because I lost. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're definitely a winner in freestyle. Do you like winning? Do you like competing? What's, what do you enjoy more, competitions or shows? Um, I enjoy both. I like to tour because you get to meet new people and you get to do shows in a lot of places that you've never been before and places that people haven't seen you do freestyle. And I enjoy competition because you get to see all the new tricks and it's a lot of fun being able to go out there and compete in front of a bunch of people. Well, do you prepare for yourself? Do you prepare yourself for competitions any differently than you prepare for shows? Oh, yeah. You, two weeks ahead of time, you're out there practicing the same run over and over again to get it dialed. In a show, it's every single trick that you know how to do. Where do you practice when you <coughs> train for shows or competitions? Camarillo, on the Camarillo ramp and out in front of open air bike shop for my ground. And your Camarillo ramp's pretty famous in the magazines. What makes that place so special? Just the ramp. It's a big ramp and you can get high airs on it. That downhill runway must help out too, doesn't it? Definitely. I've seen you hit 12 feet on that thing. It's unbelievable. What do you think of when you're up there that high? I don't know. It just feels good. It feels really good to be up there. It's that Camarillo air, That's huh? it. <laughs> None of the smog like in L.A. What do you like to do when you're not freestyling? Um, I like to snow ski. I like to motorcycle. Um, I like to go to the beach and boogie board and skimboard every once in a while and just hang out at the bike shop. And do chicks dig you at the beach? <laughs> chicks dig everybody at the beach. <laughs> not just Dino DeLuca. It's well, I'm going to have you tell me what it's like to float through the air when you're <clears> doing this one variation here. Let's take a look at the monitor. This is the uh, top side one footer, bottom side one hander aerial. And approaching the ramp, you want to do like a regular aerial. And once you're in the air, lay onto your coaster brake, take your top side foot off, your bottom side one hand off, and you do your extension and you come back on and you try to do as smooth air as possible. Okay, my next trick that I'm going to do is a look back, and I do my look backs a little bit different than everybody else because I take my foot off, but the best way to explain it is to go up and do like a regular aerial, and then to start your look back, you sort of like do a kick out and twist your handlebars around at the same time, so it's not all your back end swinging it around, and it's not all your front end, it's a little bit combined. The way I do mine is when I'm getting it kicked around almost to the full position, I take my foot off so I can turn my handlebars a lot more so I can get an extra rotation out of it, like an extra quarter way around. And then to come back out of it, you sort of reverse everything and come back in and put your foot on and twist your bars around and bring your back end around and come back in as smooth as possible. You've shown us two hot ramp variations that everybody knows you're famous for. A lot of people don't realize you're a good ground rider too. You do pedal pickers and all kinds of stuff, don't you? That's right. Why don't you show us a how-to for the pedal picker? Okay. Um, on the pedal picker, on the screen right here, I start out into it like a decade, and I use the coaster brake, and it's sort of like halfway up through the decade, you jump straight to your pedals, and then you start to pogo to keep your balance, and while pogoing, you can do different variations, such as a no-hander, or you can bounce, and then you can do like little one-footers, or whatever different variations you can think of, and the best way to come out of it is like jumping the rest of the way through a decade, and rolling right back out of it. I think Dino DeLuca's proven that he's one hot ramp and ground rider. Is there anything you'd like to say before we cut to some action? Yeah, I'd like to thank everybody that's made it possible for me to be at the point in freestyle that I'm at right now, and that's all. That's great.
We hope you've enjoyed the demo tape half as much as we've enjoyed putting it together. Thanks for joining us.